New at four this afternoon, the Office of Consumer Affairs says if you're using a private company to collect child support payments, you're going to want to hear this. There's a new Georgia law that requires those companies to register with the state. But so far, no one's done that. CBS Atlanta's John Cater joins us. He's live right now with the details. And Stephanie, good afternoon to you. That law went into effect July 1st. We're told by sponsors of the bill it was specifically put into place as a push to make sure these companies engaging in collecting child support are legit. The Governor's Office of Consumer Affairs is sending out a consumer alert on the heels of a new Georgia law aimed at protecting parents and their children. Specifically, if you're seeking to have a private company collect outstanding child support payments, make sure they've filed a contract with the state. To date, no one has filed that contract. So we're sitting here in a situation with, you know, nobody in compliance with the law if there's somebody collecting this child support. For now, Georgia's Office of Child Support Services has a 59% success rate when it comes to collecting back payments. The result, many parents are forced to turn to outside collection agencies for help. Yet still, that may not always be the best way. Consider this. We discovered Support Kids, a Texas-based company claiming to do business in Georgia, filed Chapter 7 bankruptcy on Monday. The fouling took place one day before they were set to have a hearing that would have required the company filed documentation with the state. And officials say that's just one company. I would be fairly certain there are businesses out there that are collecting child support right now that in, in doing so they would be outside the law. The new law states there must be at least three months of child support arrearages before a company can collect. It also caps the fees they'll be able to charge you. The Office of Consumer Affairs says in the end when any money is collected most of it should be coming back to the parent and child. So do we just want to make sure everybody is you know working inside the lines? And if you opt to do business with an agency that is collecting child support payments, then you should go to the Office of Consumer Affairs website where they are posting a list of companies they have approved. We are live downtown just outside of the Capitol. John Cater, CBS Atlanta News.